The radiator pressure cap is fitted above the radiator tank, and it is connected to the expansion tank with the help of a hose. The safety stop prevents the cap from being opened too quickly, and the cam lock pushes the two gaskets against the ceiling surfaces when the cap is installed. The radiator pressure cap keeps a car cool by sealing and pressurizing the coolant inside. Radiator pressure cap seals the cooling system using two gaskets, the upper gasket prevents coolant from escaping to the outside, and the lower gasket keeps pressure in the radiator. The pressure cap pressurizes the cooling system, it consists of two valves, the pressure relief valve and the vacuum relief valve. The pressure cap keeps the coolant in a predetermined amount of pressure hence preventing the vaporization of the coolant. Pressurizing a liquid increases its boiling point. The coolant's boiling point increases by about 3 degrees Fahrenheit for each psi increase in pressure. The rating of the pressure cap indicates the maximum pressure at which the pressure cap opens. Always replace the cap with the same pressure rating as recommended by the vehicle manufacturer. Generally, caps are designed from 4 PSI, 30 kPa, to 30 PSI, 205 kPa. High-performance caps range from 19 to 32 PSI. Manufacturers can design engines with higher operating temperatures. At atmospheric pressure the vacuum valve is closed and the pressure relief valve is closed. As the coolant temperature rises, the coolant inside the radiator expands and pressure builds against the pressure valve in the radiator cap until a preset pressure, the valve opens. Thus the hot coolant flows into an overflow tank and lowers the pressure inside the radiator. When the radiator cools down, the pressure drops and creates a vacuum, which causes the vacuum valve to open and allows the coolant to flow back into the radiator from the overflow tank.